Hi everyone, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to deploy your website onto Bluehost. Now, I'll be honest, I normally just use tiny.host, which is super quick and simple to use, but I'll show you Bluehost first so that we can compare the difference. So I've just logged into Bluehost's dashboard now. This is what it looks like. I also had to sign up with a credit card because they do not have a free plan. But once you get to this section, what we have to do is go to hosting on the left here. Then here is our website that they've set up. So let's select that. And I'll just show you quickly what it looks like now. You can see they've just given us a default WordPress website, but we just wanna upload just a regular website, not necessarily WordPress. So how we do that is scroll down a bit and we wanna to go to file manager on the right here. And then once this loads, what we wanna do, I think this is remembered where I was before. Basically you'll be in the home section here and then you wanna to go to public underscore HTML and double click that. So here are all the files that make up that default website that we saw earlier. You can delete all these if you want, but instead I'm just going to create a folder and we'll call it new website. So this will make a new path on the website instead of having to delete everything. So let's go into that. Okay, let's stop double clicking on the text. And now we wanna upload our files. So I'm gonna click upload on the top here. That opens up this section. So here is my website. You can see it's got a brain folder, an index.html, and a readme. So to make things quick, I'm gonna select everything and compress it, get this archive.zip, and then drag that archive.zip over here, and now that is complete. So we should be able to go back and reload this section. Now we have that archive.zip. Now we can right click, click extract, extract it into the folder that we just created. You can see that's saying everything it did. We can reload that again. And now you can see our website is ready to go. So if we go back to our website, like I mentioned, we made it a folder path called new website. So if we click that, wait for it to load, here's the website. So it's a simple calculator. You can see all the CSS and JavaScript is set up. So that is how you upload your website to Bluehost. Now I'll show you how to upload your website with tiny.host, which is what I normally use. Now, this is what their dashboard looks like. I've just logged in, but I did need to put in my credit card details. They do have a free plan, which is awesome. So to get started, I'm gonna click the upload button here, and you can see we can upload a HTML, PDF, PHP, zip file, or a few of their examples they have. So like we saw before, I've got a zip file, so I'm just gonna get that and drag it into the upload section. And we can actually choose our link name. So I'm gonna call this my calculator and then scroll down. We can add some restrictions if we want to, but I think that's okay. We can also add a custom domain if we want to, but I'm just gonna keep it with theirs. So with all that, let's click publish. And in just a few seconds, you can see super quick, our website is ready already. And now when we click that, you can see here's the calculator from before set up with tiny.host. If you enjoyed this video and wanna see more tips from us, please remember to like and subscribe. With that all said, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.